Good morning. I hope everything's going all right. I hope y'all are in good health. And I'm going to go ahead and go over this so that you can get started on your own DIY problem. All right. And it is very realistic because in a couple of years, you're going to be driving on your own and you're going to have to think about, hey, can I afford um, going to uh, uh, on a trip or so forth? And you have to figure out costs of the trip. You'll have to figure out costs for even just going into town. All right, so let's go ahead and go through this, and we're going to go ahead and talk about all the things that I want you to answer on your DIY problem today, okay? Excuse me, allergies. <laughs> but anyway, uh, first things first, okay? Uh, let's go ahead and talk about this. Uh, this will be a linear equation that you're going to go ahead and go through, okay? So let's first talk about the relationship. Well, whenever you drive your car, all right, uh, you have a correlation between your cost and your miles, all right? Now, which one's independent, which one's dependent? Let's figure that out. Independent and dependent. What is your independent variable? Is your cost your independent variable or your, de de or your dependent variable? Well, cost depend your cost that you spend depends on how much you drive, right? How many miles you drive. Because the more miles you drive, then... Uh, the more gas you burn, which means the more cost, right? So, therefore, your independent variable is miles driven, right? And then dependent variable is your cost. So, now that I know that, I know that my miles is my X, cost is my Y. Okay? So, let's go ahead and go through here. My Y is cost. My X is miles. There we go. Okay. Now let's go ahead and get started on this part. All right. So I made this for you just for you. Okay. You don't have to go through anything else. I just made this formula. This formula is Y equals your miles times the total cost divided by your miles per gallon. Good enough? Okay. So. Your miles. Your miles are your x's, so therefore, we have our y, and that equals our x. What is my cost? My cost, like I told you today, is right now, uh, gas is going for like a buck fifty. So it's not too bad. In some areas, it might be cheaper. Okay? And then your miles per gallon. Well, it's going to differ between on which car you use. If you use a smart car, it's going to be like 50 miles per gallon. But if you're using a monster truck, like I'm going to demonstrate today, then it's going to be a lot less because it needs more fuel to propel it forward. All right. So right now I'm going to use five miles per gallon. Okay. Now I put it right under there. Now let's go ahead and try to simplify it. What's 1.5 times X? 1.5 X, right? So it comes out to 1.5 X all over Five. Now, can't I simplify this? This is just another fraction. Could also mean 1.5x or 1.5 over 5 times x, right? So let's go ahead and simplify it. So what is 1.5 divided by 5? 0.3x. Now wait. 0.3. That means 0.3 is my slope, right? What's my y-intercept? It's there, but it's zero, right? Does that make sense? If you don't drive anywhere, then there's no cost. Hey, all right, so we're leading on the right track. Good, okay? Now, um, point three is my slope. Point three what? Well, cost, right? So point three is the, the cost per mile, right? Cost per mile. The cost is 0.3 in dollars, also means 30 cents. All right? So it is. it costs you 30 cents per mile. Cost 30 cents per mile. Dang. That is expensive, if you don't know. All right? That is very expensive. If you just go five miles, you just spend a whole gap. And that's a buck fifty right out of your wallet. You might be able to think you can afford it, but no. <laughs> anyway, 
going on. So I go over one and go up 0.3, go over one, go up 0.3, go over one, go up 0.3, and so forth. There it is, okay? As long as I label that way, right? One, two, 0 0.3, 0 0.6, so forth, okay? So this is what I'm gonna ask you, ask from you. A is going to be your uh, equation, which is y equals 0.3x. Your B, okay? Oh my goodness, I am so sorry. Your A is not that. Your A, I need you to figure out is, what is your car? Your, and so mine is a monster truck. MT, MPG for your monster truck, which is five. Okay, your C is going to be your equa equation, so Y equals 0.3X, all right? D, graph it, and then E. Uh, I want you to Figure out the cost of going from here to, let's say, Florida, all right? And the cost of that is what I need you to figure out for your particular problem. And that will be, let's say, 1,000 miles. Okay? So I completed all of these. Graph, I graphed it. 1,000. What do you think I did with 1,000? I plug it in for x. So if I have y equals 0.3x, plug this in for x, it would be y equals 0.3 times 1,000, which will be, and you can't see, 300. All right. Other than that, have a uh, uh, do that work. Get it in today. You'll be good. Have a blessed one.